The Final Sigh. Standing on the train platform, walking into the narrow margin of sunlight along the edge, trying to catch the last rays of summer, trying to hedge my bets, topping off that tank of vitamin D to see me through the sun-starved days of winter. I didn't do anything summer this year, didn't taste a drop of salt water. Autumn, the glorious exhalation, nature expiring or yawning deep in an explosive bouquet, a carnival before sleep. And all I can think about is putting my roots into the cellar. It's too late to put up fruit. All the vines have begun to yellow. And I think about the women I'd like to lie with because the end is near. Someone to warm the bed for the cold part of the year. Someone to pull close. Someone to share your fears. You'd like a wet kiss and a hard squeeze before the grim season slushes its way into your boots, freezes your toes, and melts your reason. If you're reading this, I'm talking about you. Well, it's true for one of you, maybe two. That's enough to make it worthwhile. I craft these poems with a mischievous smile in anticipation of the final release and the little death in a sighing breath and the stillness of a silent repose and pulling the blankets right up under your nose. Ha, ha, ha.